In Leviticus chapter 20 and verses 7 and 8, the Bible describes God as Jehovah M. Kedesh, which simply means God, the one who sanctifies us, the one who sets us apart. And he tells the children of Israel, he says, to consecrate yourselves and that they are to be holy because he is the Lord God who makes them holy. He is the one who sanctifies us and makes us holy. And, and such a wonderful thought. God wants us to be holy. Now we need to understand what that word holy means. It means set apart and in a category all its own. You see, God is holy. He's absolute purity. And He wants us to become like Him. And to become holy means to become like Jesus Christ. And, and so God is the one who makes us that way. He tells us to be that way, but then he says, I am the one who will make you that way. And when you pursue God and you pursue him as God in Kedesh, that you will be pursuing the one who will make you more and more and more like Jesus Christ. And what a joy that is. I tell you, when you come to the end of your life, you will be a, a beautiful person. Today, you know, we think of beautiful people as being the slim, the trim, the fit, the strong, the young, and all of this. But I want to tell you something. You know who the most beautiful person I've ever met? One of the most beautiful people I've ever met is a man by the name of Dr. Frank Laubach. I met him when I first became a Christian. My wife and I met him. He was at Asbury College and Seminary. Great Methodist uh, teacher of the Word of God. Great man of prayer. Uh, Dr. Laubach was mightily used to help educate the illiterate, and he, he developed a, a way of teaching people literacy and helped so many people around the world to learn to read and to write, and such a great man. And I remember when I met him, he was so much like Jesus. He was about 90 years old, and he had walked with the Lord so many years looking to the Lord, seeking the Lord's face, and God, Jehovah and Kedesh, had made him a beautiful man. You see, the more you become like Jesus, the more beautiful you are. You may be, as a young person, great, strong, beautiful, all of this, but I tell you what, the greatest beauty in the world is the inward beauty, and only God can make you beautiful on the inside because He is the one who sanctifies you. He is the one who makes you more like Jesus Christ. So today I want to challenge you to get to know God as our sanctifier, the one who makes us beauty, beautiful on the inside. And when you seek Him, He will make you more like Jesus. And the older you get, the more beautiful you'll become.